Not only is it the weekend, May 7th, 8th, and 9th, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday, but it is Mother's Day on the 8th. Oh, I love this holiday. This is matter whether you're a mom or not. Let's start there. You are a mom of your pet. You are a mom of your niece. You are a mom of your best friend. And you might be a mom of the children you have. <laughs> that would be suggested. So the mother energy, and it can be a man. I don't know why we get so carried away with only women being moms. There are those personality types like this one. Sun is in Taurus. Moon is in Leo. They're both caretakers. Taurus does everything to make the world softer. Leo gets so often who they love and they love to give to people. So it's a very generous weekend. There's a lot of energy about loving and the mom, please. Mother is not just the kids. Mother is our mother earth. So in the name of Taurus, that Mother's Day came in the name of Taurus. I think that's so great. It means you smell the flowers. It means you bake. It means that you make sure you're outside and you feel the sun on your face. This is what May 7th, 8th, and 9th is about. The moon is in Leo. A little bit of entertainment would be helpful. Thinking about buying flowers for your mom. Making sure you do a love card, some kind of a special Hallmark card, or better yet, make one. Or think of the people in your world who have mothered you. It doesn't have to be your mom. Some of the most powerful women in my life mothered me because I didn't have a mom. It was really hard when I was a kid to get a Mother's Day card. I would read them and then just, I couldn't buy it for her because I didn't have that kind of connection. But now that I'm a grown-up, there are definitely women that I can say thank you and make sure you know how much I appreciate how much you give me. So that's the flavor of the weekend. And as you know, to, on one day, on Tuesday, Mercury's going to go retrograde. So just be aware that this weekend is our last chance in the name of Taurus Leo to really have some fun. Guilt-free cards. There's a lot of chi. The sun and moon are squaring each other. See if you notice when that happens, especially if you're a Scorpio or an Aquarian. It's tense energy. Or those Leo moms are going, whoa, it's my weekend. And someone's giving me presents and making breakfast in bed and telling me they love me and bought me. Oh my goodness. This is the best thing of all. Mother's Day. Yes. Even if you don't have a mom, there's somebody that mommed you. Think about it. Astrology Answers wanted me to tell you, happy Mother's Day.